you know, in terms of like getting, again, people into the sport and filling, you know, raising all the boats, um, what role do you think the, the smaller resorts, the micro resorts, the ski areas, the, the feeders in the industry, what, what role do they play? Well, I think they play a big role, right? I mean, they're closer to the people. Yeah. Right. So we're further away. So, you know, we've tried to partner with some of the some of the more regional resorts to try. Yeah, we have. So so for, say, Mountain Creek and Wachusett, some of those type of resorts, we have deals where their pass holders can come up here and get a deal. You know, the, the theory is they learn there and then as they get better or they aspire to come to a bigger resort. So, you know, for us, that makes a lot of sense for them to be a feeder into our resort, right. you know, as maybe a weekend destination as opposed to, you know, maybe they started night skiing or something there. If that is the, the, the head of the funnel, um, would, it, would it make sense to ever, you know, just throwing stuff against the, the wall here to be, you know, have, you know, should it be a, a fund with a grant program or something to help these ski areas mm -hmm. with? I think it's reasonable. I mean, we've helped a, a bunch, you know, say for an old groomer, we've, you know, donated a, to some of the smaller ones right. around in New York and, cool. and Vermont and yeah. say Cochran's or those type yeah. of resorts. We try to awesome. help out. So, you know, there's a lot of those around here that we've been trying to do things on our own. And uh -huh. I think a lot of the other resorts are doing some things. But so yeah, it's been there's, kind of happening on, I think there's some the of that organic. happening organically yeah. where, you know, we all realize we should try to help. Maybe yeah. there is, should there be a bigger program that probably worth talking about? Yeah. Yeah. Interesting.